Paul, what's up? Hey, so just to add to your conversation, without actually necessarily giving an opinion, um, when you take a look at uh, the history of the draft and running backs, right, like 2000 and up, uh, just off the top of my head, you got Adrian Peterson, Cedric Benson, LaDainian Tomlinson, you got guys like Chris Johnson, Ezekiel Elliott, um, Le'Veon Bell, Derek Henry, um, Saquon Barkley, and none of them have a ring. That's true. Right? That's absolutely so even, true. Even if they are the guy, for some reason, um, more often than not, these guys wind up in a situation where with the first team that they're on, they don't have a ring. Like, Marshawn's got a ring, but not on the team that drafted him. Um, same thing with Christian McCaffrey. He got a ring, but not – I mean, no, he didn't get a ring, but still, he was close with the Super Bowl. But Marshawn Lynch United. might have had one if they would have given him the ball at the end of the game. Well, I know. He does. Regardless, Seattle didn't draft Lynch. And I believe the that's Bills fair. did. No, that's fair. But he would have had so, – he could have been that guy if they would have given him the ball at the end of the game, correct? But not for the team that drafted him is the point. Correct. Um, so when, when it comes to drafting a running back, I mean, sure, go ahead. But history will tell you that it just tends to not work out. Now, I got another little uh, question for you. Of course. Beyond that topic, just some uh, draft history for the Bears. Um, when was the last time the Chicago Bears had two first-round picks? In the first round? Yes. Are you asking me, or are you asking me if I know? Well, so, I mean, I didn't know. I had to go through and look it up. I mean, I'm asking you if you know. No, I, I don't tell you. But, I don't know off yeah. the top of my head. Um, so, it was in 2003. Yes, okay. And we drafted Michael Haynes. Mm -hmm. And then, like, two, three picks later, um, Troy Palomalu went. Yep. And then we took Rex Rose yep. after that. But, Sexy Rexy yeah, Gross one. And then since then, so, you know, I mean, I was in high school, early high school back then. So for most of my football-watching career in life, the Bears have never had two first-round picks. This is why Ryan Poles is making things so exciting, because now the future here is really bright when it comes to the draft and building and things like that. And it's just something different that the Bears haven't done in the last 20 years. And so, I don't know, in Poles we trust. I think if... Uh, you know, I don't think he's going to draft a running back that high, um, and I think he showed that by getting rid of Montgomery. I don't think that value for that position is worth it. Um, but if he does, he does. I mean, it's it's his team. He's the general manager. You know, I don't know what he's going to do. However, I think uh, I think you're going to hope to get a position that's going to last you more than four or five, six years from that. And usually, running backs don't last more than four to six years in this league. So, good call, Paul. Thanks very much. Thank you, man.